Good morning, interwebs. We are on our third day, third full day in the hospital, I think. Yeah, today's Wednesday. Ooh, guess what? It's 7.30. I can take more ibuprofen. Good. I'm pretty sore still. I am not necessarily looking forward to going home tomorrow and not having help all day, but I'm looking forward to going home tomorrow. It's gonna suck because I'm gonna have a hard time getting up to the hospital for the next week. I'm sure rides in the car aren't going to be fun and I can't drive. But uh, I am ready to be out of here. Well, it's good otherwise. I got a little more sleep last night. I'm hoping to try and take some more naps today. I got to get into the napping routine. And that's about it. So we're about to do breakfast here. I'm making some tea. Some most delicious tea, of course. We have some carbs. I added some grits on because, frankly, nursing makes you really hungry. And I was counting down the minutes until the, the kitchen opened. Oh, look, we have a flower this morning. Isn't that lovely? Um, the eggs, uh, they leave something to be desired. But you know what? It's food. It's protein. And I need it. I am far more hungry now than I was when I was pregnant. Apparently, nursing does this to you. Hopefully you enjoyed the video yesterday. We got a lot of good shots in the NICU. Um, and my husband is feeling better, so we got to spend some time. I'm wearing a mask off um, when I'm in there right now, just in case I get sick. I, I feel okay, but not great. So I don't know how much of that is C-section and how much is maybe I'm get coming down with what he had. So I'm just trying to be careful as much as I can because I do not want to get her sick. So, oh, and you got to see your name. Yeah, we actually came up with a name. Um, we actually had that name on there a while ago and uh, several versions of it, so we've been kind of playing with it for the last couple of days, deciding what we wanted. But I think it works. So, we're happy. All right, I gotta eat. This isn't too bad of a setting for lunch. I got flowers from some family. It's not too bad. Just wish my baby was sitting here too. But she's in the NICU. Just got done with an hour-long hold session. She did really well. Um, she's getting a little jaundice, so they have her under the ultraviolet uh, light or whatever it is. So she's got the little nightshades on, and so I can only hold her so much. But uh, I don't know if it's settled in all the way that I'm a mom now, but uh, I am. I'm sure it'll settle in a lot more in a few weeks when she comes home. I'm assuming this is pretty normal of not being able to feel like a parent per se when your child is in an incubator in another room. I hope I can get rid of that feeling soon. I don't like it. I want to be a mom. Alright, I gotta eat. I gotta take care of myself. I gotta get over the surgery thing. Do you like the do? I cannot recall what I've told you today because all the days are sort of blending into one. She's doing well. Her um, bilirubin has gone up, which is jaundice, which is just sort of a normal thing that a lot of preemies and even newborns get. So kind of to be expected, we pretty much didn't think she'd skip that. So she's been under a blue light all day, which you saw in the previous clip, an ultraviolet light to help bring that down. So. Pretty normal. Um, she's going number two and doing all of that, so she'll get better quickly. Um, they keep going down in small increments on her oxygen and pressure needs, so that's all good. So everything's good there. I am so freaking sore. Apparently, C-sections are major surgery. I have good moments and I have bad moments, um, but I'm trying to stay on my meds. I'm just doing ibuprofen. No narcotics, I just don't like narcotics. They totally mess with my system and my stomach. So, I've been maintaining on ibuprofen. I go home tomorrow. It's going to be horrible. Um, yeah, it's going to be horrible. Um, the emotions are here. My breast milk is coming in. I'm a hormonal mess. And leaving her here tomorrow is going to be tough. This is not fun. Oh, hormones. This is part of being mom. 
it's just a little intense right now. I feel torn between taking care of myself and taking care of her, taking care of my husband to some degree. He's still sick and kind of up and down. And I have to make him do certain things that maybe he doesn't want to do, you know, like stay home sometimes. He wants to see me and he wants to see the baby, but he can't get either of us sick. So it's kind of a really tough spot. It's all temporary. It's all temporary. We're talking days. So, okay. I gotta get a couple things done. Eat dinner, pump, repeat. <laughs>